So I'm just going to jump in here. Tell yeah. me how much you love what you do. I love it so much. Why? <laughs> Um, what's really great about it is that I'm really, I feel like I'm helping people and that's something that I really wanted for my job. Can you give me a very kind of top line explanation of what actually is Google Analytics? When you own a website, uh, sometimes you want to understand how people are using it better. Could be that you just want to understand how many people have come to it, where they've come from or what they're doing on your site. When you want to analyze sure. uh, the, how people are using your, your site, you can visualize inf information in a way that makes it so it's actionable. Talking specifically to a small business, mm -hmm. how is what you do on a day-to-day -day basis really affecting somebody who's not thinking internationally, not thinking globally, right. just, just getting started? Google Analytics is free and open to everyone. And so that's one of the really cool things where we can bring a lot of really powerful tools to a bunch of small business owners, small website owners. Before you even start building your website, before mm -hmm. you even start to figure out what you're looking for in an analytics report, yep. you just really want to figure out what your goals are. And then make sure that you build your website with those goals in mind. Say, I own a restaurant. I really want people to go view my menu. Are people getting to my menu page? You know, if it turns out that 99% of people just stay on the home page and they never see your, your menu, well, maybe there's something wrong there with how they can get to your menu. So that's the approach that you can start to take when trying to figure out how you should use this information. So what kind of information are we talking about here? Analytics sounds like something that I might be interested in, but what is it actually going to give me? It can give you a ton of different information. It can give you information about how many people have come to your site, how much time they've spent on your site, which pages they've gone to, uh, also things like where those people are coming from. I've decided I want to use analytics. What are the actual steps that I take to use it if I have never seen it before? Yeah, if you want to get started with Google Analytics, uh, the first thing you need to do is sign up. And that's all free? It's all free. Okay. Uh, and you basically go to google.com slash analytics, and you click on a button that says access or sign up. At that point, uh, it'll put you into a flow that says, you know, what kind of website are you? Um, it'll give you some tips and tricks about you know, where this would be useful. But basically, you get to the end of the flow. It gives you a little line of code basically, okay. just you can copy and paste and you put it at the bottom of your website. I think that what we really want to make sure is that people aren't daunted by this whole idea of analyzing, there's all these numbers, what do I do with all these numbers? We're constantly trying to make the numbers seem less daunting uh, and so that people can really get value out of it. It was an absolute pleasure <laughs> chatting this with you. This was super fun, I really <laughs> enjoyed it.